Did you know that plants can communicate with each other through an underground network of fungi? Scientists call it the wood wide web. This network of fungal threads connects trees and plants in forests, allowing them to share nutrients, water, and even warning signals about threats like insect attacks. The fungi form symbiotic relationships with plant roots called mycorrhizal networks. They extend the plant's reach for water and nutrients in exchange for sugars the plant produces through photosynthesis. But here's where it gets fascinating. When a tree is under attack by insects, it can release chemical signals through these fungal networks to warn neighboring trees. Neighboring trees then boost their own natural defenses before being attacked. In a landmark 1997 study, Ecologist Suzanne Simard discovered that Douglas fir and paper birch trees share carbon with each other through this network. More carbon flows from the tree in full sunlight to the one in shade. Older, larger mother trees can recognize their seedlings and preferentially send them resources, essentially nurturing their own offspring. This intricate communication system challenges our perception of plants as passive organisms. Forests aren't just collections of individual trees. They're complex societies with sophisticated communication systems that have evolved over 400 million years. Next time you walk through a forest, remember, beneath your feet lies a vast, ancient internet of fungi and roots, buzzing with conversations we're only beginning to understand.